Gravitas, co-presented by Škoda. Kushak, choose what really matters. Because the South China Sea is not the only problem that China is creating. Almost every day now, China is threatening Taiwan. The PLA is invading the Taiwanese airspace. Taiwan has now decided to spend almost $9 billion more to defend itself. Military upgrades. And even that might not be enough to contain the military tensions in the region. Is China planning to invade Taiwan? Earlier this month, China sent nuclear bombers into Taiwan's airspace. The move sent alarm bells ringing in Taipei. Taiwan now says it is facing severe threats from China. It wants to spend close to $9 billion on military upgrades. The money will be used to buy new missiles and weapons over five years. These upgrades are no longer optional. The Chinese are breathing down Taiwan's neck. Taiwan's defense ministry recently released a dire assessment. It said China's armed forces can paralyze Taiwan's defenses. The PLA can fully monitor Taiwanese deployments. It can conduct crippling cyber attacks that will disarm air defenses, the command of the sea and counterattack systems. These capabilities make the possibility of an invasion look real. For Taiwan, the challenge is existential. They have a modern force, but no real match for the PLA. It's a David versus Goliath scenario. Taiwan is preparing for the worst. They are conducting their annual military drills. Taiwan's forces simulated various conflict scenarios involving the Chinese military, like biological and electronic attacks and a full-scale military invasion. Taiwanese jets rehearsed how to land their planes on highways if the Chinese military decides to blow up their airbases. Taiwan is standing up to the Chinese threat. But its moves have provoked an unlikely critic, North Korea. Its state mouthpiece has published a piece. It slammed the United States for backing Taiwan and stirring up trouble for China. This comes as Pyongyang itself is intensifying missile tests. North Korea has conducted its second test in a week. It launched a missile from a train. The missile flew for 800 kilometers before hitting a target within North Korea. First, China's aggressive moves against Taiwan. Now, North Korea's missile launches. The growing military provocations are making the Asia-Pacific a more dangerous place. Bureau Report, we on World is One. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move. Gravitas, co-presented by Škoda. Kushak, choose what really matters.